Victor here and we are on Zoo Crafting. Welcome back. I am standing in our very new Chocobo pen right next to Linaris. And I've actually been taking a break from working in um, down in the beast area and doing all that big building and digging because I realized I've been wanting to make a Chocobo pen forever. I went out and I found two Chocobos. We've got Fortune here and over here is Fury. And I got those two and I started breeding and I got Oscar and Venus. And then Venus and Oscar have made Butts <laughs> and Lola and our brand new baby white Chocobo named Quistus. She's so pretty. Now we, when Quistus grows up, we need to breed her with a yellow Chocobo to get a, I want to say a black Chocobo. Yeah, you need to eat, breed her with a yellow. So, yay! And they're super cool because they're so nice and easy to run around in with. I've been using the lovely Gishels from our other farm. I'm saving the golden ones for uh, when we have want to breed a gold chocobo. But see, look at this. I'm not really sitting on her but, or him. <laughs> I made a chocobo. <laughs> if you guys know, I love Final Fantasy. And in Worlds of Wonder, we had a chocobo ranch. and It was amazing. Zambo is getting over here. So that's what I've been doing. Uh, let me see here. What else we got? Um, so Lunaris, actually, actually, um, we have it, uh, Synchro actually named it for me. So the Teller's Teleport Point set called Lunaris. Um, I made a gate out here. Let me get my cakes out. Okay, so now we're done with those. What can I eat next? I will eat fruit salad. Fruit salad! Um... Out here, I made a I made a farm out or a path out here to the orchard, so we don't have to go around every time. Uh, I got the nutmeg tree growing, the chestnut tree, uh, the cinnamon tree is still is doing really good. Look at this. Any more cinnamon? Nope, not really. Uh, we've got some chestnuts. Look at that. That's amazing. I'm gonna harvest all these nuts and put them in Louise. Cause nuts. Nutmeg. Oh, this is amazing. Yeah. What else we got? So we got cinnamon. These are something else. We got some pecans. It's all the pecans. Pistachios. Nom nom nom. All the nut trees in the orchard are doing great. They must have been growing because I was nearby. Uh, we got pecans. We already, we already harvest pecans. Uh, what are these? Cashews. Cashews are like my favorite favorite nut. Hi, horsey. How you doing? And then over here we got some vanilla. Gotta love some vanilla. Oh, yeah. It's gonna make good additions to all of our farming, or all of our meals at Louie's. We got figs. Num, num, num. And I'm pretty sure... Yep, I did. These are walnuts. The coconut tree, I did try to plant it in sand. It would not plant in sand whatsoever. And it still won't grow. We've got a maple tree now. I read your comments. You told me to mix a maple tree with a spruce. Or maple with a spruce. And you have a maple tree. So there's that. Okay, let's go put all this stuff into Louie's house. Let's see what the some of the recipes we can make with it. We're not actually going to cook today. But maybe next episode we'll make something. Let's go take a look. We'll go see what sort of recipes we can make. We gotta make some pancakes. Can we make pancakes with this? Let me see. Maple syrup. Uh, I can make ma maple sausage. Maple oatmeal. Maple candied bacon. That sounds good. M and a maple sapling. Maple syrup pancakes. We're gonna do that. We're gonna make some pancakes one of these days. With some egg and some flour and some milk. We're gonna make pancakes and make maple syrup pancakes because everybody likes pancakes. I personally like me some blueberry pancakes, but there's that. What other things can we make with walnuts? Fondue. All right. Can we make brownies with walnuts? Banana nut bread. Lots of banana nut bread. Mince pie baklava. Pineapple upside down cake. That's awesome. We have pineapples too. We don't have cherries though. Zucchini bread. Ooh, we should make some zucchini bread sometime. Walnut raisin bread. That sounds good. Candied walnuts. How do you make raisins? 
Oh, we cooked the grapes so we can make raisins. Yes. It's amazing. What can we make with cashews before I put them away? Mince pie, cashew chicken. That sounds tasty. Some trail mix. Yes. We should make trail mix. Date nut bread and the cashew sapling. What about figs? What can we make with figs? Mince pie, fruit crumble, fig bar, fruit bait. That's for fishing. Fruit punch and a fruit salad. Oh, there's more. There's fig jelly, fig smoothie, fig yogurt. Sold. Okay, so we're going to put some of this stuff back here. Let's put the maple syrup here. Pecans, walnuts. Wait. Walnuts. That's easier. Why don't I do that? Heck yeah. Check that out. And I can do it that way. I put stuff in shelves that way. Is it all the food? Uh, no, figs. All right. So let's go. That's kind of cool. Do, 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 do. Must be raining. Okay, back to our temple. Uh, which is this way. Winter's Temple. Travel. Now, if you look here, Lunaris. Awesome! It's no longer called Winter's Base. It's called Lunaris. Uh, this is still Winter's Temple, but I don't know. We should probably change it so it says Win Winter's Gemstone Canopy or something. Something like that. So, I realized last episode, right after... Ooh, what's this? Presents from Santa's Grotto. I thought I got all my presents from Santa Santa's Grotto. Cool. I need more marble. I've been using a ton of marble. Let's go put this into my storage. Really quick so we don't have a ton of marble in my inventory. Nom nom. Put away, put away, put away. Ignore the chocobo cooked meat. <laughs> there was an accident with one of the chocobos and I cried. Okay, so... Romeo can go in there too. I was growing more gishels down the farm area. So I realized that I named the birds and I didn't show you guys the names of the birds. So we need to go and hang out in the aviary so I can show you what I named the birds. Can I say birds any more times? Probably not. So let's go down... Let's take a look at all our birds. We're going to go start with the penguins. We're not going to actually, like, I don't know. We're not going to actually grow any more penguins because we've decided we have enough penguins. Oh, yeah. Look at all the eggs they've been laying. We're going to collect these, though. We don't want eggs to go to waste. How are my babies doing? Maybe we'll go give Mara some penguin babies. But you should love some penguin babies. I think we're going to go give Mara a present. Because I love Mara. She needs more presents. Mara needs penguin babies. There we go. So let's go take a look at our... No, 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 no. Okay. Let's go take a look at our peacocks. Now these guys, their eggs have a very low, I've noticed, spawn rate. Oh, <gasps> We got a new baby! Look at it! I don't know if it's a boy or a girl, so we'll have to come back to it later. That is such a coincidence because I was just saying how they have a very low spawn rate when we hatch them. So, awesome. We've got our very first bred in captivity. Not really captive. Uh, inhabited. Bred in habitat. Oh, she's following her mama. Bred in a habitat. Peafowl. Oh, she's following Indira. Look at that. They just, she follows her mama. I gotta take a picture of you. Can I take a picture of you? Can you let me take a picture of you? Come on. Let me. Oh, look at you. You're beautiful. You are so beautiful. Amazing. Okay. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm so excited. It was our first bred peafowl. We have not had one like successfully hatched from an egg since we started. Everything else has been hatching. Okay, we decided no more swans because we've got enough swans. So we're just going to collect the eggs. All of our swans are amazing. Oh, did I not show you guys what I named the peafowls? That's so... I went in there to go show you guys, and then I just didn't show you guys. I'm special. 
We knew this. I named, I like, uh, I liked the names, uh, the color names. I can't remember who suggested it. If you suggested it, I think I loved it. Uh, I named, ooh, there's another egg. I named this one Sepia. And this one's Lazuli, like for blue. Cause Sepia is more of a brownish color and Lazuli is a blue color. So that's what I named them. I like the names. So there you go. So let's go down to our next ones, not the swans, our ducks, which is over here. Still haven't put up a basket. And here are our duckies. I don't know what kind of ducks they are. Here's Donald and Daisy. And they're just swimming around. I don't know what kind of ducks they are. I think they're both females. They both are brown, so I don't know if they're both females or whatnot. I'm not sure. Or if they're still babies. Donald, do you guys, are you guys boys or both girls? Do I need to get you a boy duck? I don't know. <laughs> so that's Donald and Daisy. Maybe they're both, maybe Donald's really a Donna and Daisy. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> So there's that. Uh, I don't think I've done any progress though on the beast area. I think I've been like leaving that alone because like I said, I was kind of getting burnt out digging it out and um, building. Um, I'm thinking, what am I thinking? I'm thinking we want to try making a carpenter door and I want to see if it works. I don't know if it's going to work the way I want it to work. I need fruit salad. Actually I don't because there's cakes laying everywhere literally. Like right there. There we go. So I need a carpenter door. I think I might have one spare. Or not. I guess I don't. Well, dang. Okay. And so we need a carpenter door. And we need a carpenter hammer, which I think is in my bag. Yep. Nope, that's my juicer. Carpenter hammer. So we're gonna go try to figure out how to get the carpenter hammer to, or the carpenter door to work in the aviary. I don't know how this is gonna work. I don't know if you can make glass textures. I'm gonna see. We're gonna see this, if it's gonna work. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I'm wondering if we could put it on a pillar. That might work. Let's go find out. We could put it on this pillar right here. Let's see. No, because it won't show up right there. It need to be on a flat surface. I don't know. Do I have any glass in my bag? I don't. Can you put glass in a carpenter door? I don't even know. Let's go get a glass block and a glass panel. We're about to see if this is gonna work. Probably not. But hey, I don't have anything else to do today because that was pretty much it. I've been breeding chocobos. I made the chocobo pen. I went down to the farm. I've been, that was about it. That's about all I've been doing. Seriously. <laughs> since, since Wednesday. That's all I've been doing is chocobos. So, okay. Don't do that. That. And that. Yeah. Okay, let's go see if this works. I need to eat it already. No, I don't. I have cake. Keep forgetting. When we're in the base, we have cake. There's this cake to eat. There we go. Bestiary. Down we go. Let's see if this is gonna work. Oh, I don't know. Maybe it won't. Let's try it though. One, two, three. Let's see my pickaxe. Oh, well it broke. And that's gonna break too. Okay, so if I, this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. Totally not gonna work. Cause. <laughs> Cause that's now sitting on the outside.
It's like obvious there's a door here. It's so obvious. <laughs> it does not blend. It does not blend at all. <laughs> oh my lord. I have no idea how I'm gonna do this. How I'm gonna pull this off. There's like no way to hide a door anywhere with this, this thing. Like I would have to literally have one that goes down and up. Uh, I have no idea how this is going to work. Uh, so, hmm. I have no clue. Maybe you guys have a good idea. Maybe. Um, let's go look at our farms really quick. See if I have any more Gashel Greens growing. I mean, I was literally just there and I haven't been sitting there since. So probably not. Where's that cake? I was eating. This one? There we go. Farm area. The fruit farm's actually coming along really nicely. I did manage to go through and get all of the different uh, fruit farms sorted. Let me show you. I'm gonna finish that cake off. Woohoo! We got rid of a cake. Uh, I got the little signed pictures going there. The ceiling still hasn't been finished. Um, so we've got pineapple, a full crop of the cactus fruit. We've got lots of kiwi. All the cranberry and the cantaloupe. So, the cantaloupe. Cantaloupe. I'm nuts. She knew that. I have nuts now. I have nut trees. <laughs> but I think that's all that I really have to do today. I mean, we can go check and see if I can breed the ba choco babies again. But I doubt it, considering I haven't been there and they don't they don't age when I'm not there, I don't think. We can go look. And try to breed us a... Uh, Choco baby. I need to break that. With the next. There we go. It's raining. It's pouring. The old man is snoring. He went to bed and he bumped his head and he couldn't get up. It's really late. Um, this is the night before that I'm going to post this. <laughs> also, like, the sun's not going down. I don't know why. Either that or it has and I just missed it. I don't know. Okay. Let's go back to Lunaris. Do, 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 do. Hi, transport box. Okay, we're gonna go. I found if I sit there for a minute before I actually move, it works better. When was there a sheep here? I heard Louie barking. Choco babies! Hi, Choco babies! Quistus is still a baby. It looks like all the other ones have grown up. Oscar's aged. Buds is aged. Lola, Venus. Oscar. Maybe Quistus will grow up here in a minute. Come on, baby. Grow. Let's see. How's Venus doing? Venus can breed. We'll breed another one. See if we can get another one. Come here. I want you to come over here. Hang out by, uh, not, not, let's go find Oscar. Actually, I can ride you over there. Let's ride you over to Oscar. There we go. And we're gonna breed you two again. Ah, they made another little blue one. And I'm gonna make you go there, there, love me. And what is your name? Air. That's interesting. So your name's Air. So with that, I think we're going to call this a day. Like if you guys have liked this video, leave me some comments down below and I will see you guys all next time in zoo crafting. Bye-bye.